Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I love Loopy's Crochet and Treasures. If you're new to my channel, my name is Tracy. I live in Alabama. I love to crochet and I love yarn. And that is mostly what my channel's about. Now sometimes I do throw in other little things here and there, but mostly it's about yarn and crochet. And if you're new, I want to welcome you. I hope you like it here and I hope you stay. And if you're the ones who always come back and watch my videos and spend time with me, I really appreciate it. Um, Y'all mean the world to me. And, um, and you bless me more than you know. And so I wanted to get on. It's been nine days since I've done a video, but I've been sick. And I'm, I think I'm on the mends now. My voice is a little funny sounding and still got a cold and everything. But I think I'm on the mends. I've been sick all week. And, um... So, but I wanted to get on. I hope y'all don't think I forgot about you because I did. It's just I wasn't able to get on to do one. And then it took me forever to get this these mystery bags from Aberdeen Wool. I think that's the name of it. And, um, and I finally got them, but I hadn't been able to open them because I've been sick. But I wanted to get on today and open them with you guys and see what I got. I know a lot of people's been opening them and they got a lot of nice yarn. And uh, so let's see what kind of yarn I got. If we got the same things as, you know, or if we all got different stuff or whatever. You know, I love to see see the yarn and, and I love the mystery of it. So I wanted to share that with you. And then I have a finished object and some uh, work in progress. And But I really haven't been able to crochet very much. So I hadn't got a whole lot done. Um... I finally updated my Etsy shop. If you don't know, I have an Etsy shop, and I'll leave it in the description box of this video if you'd like to go over and check it out. Um, I sell earrings and stitch markers and bracelets and um, cowls and shawls and you name it. I, brace, um, I think I said bracelets and necklaces and, uh, you know, just go check it out. And, um... I did mark down some of my shawls that were, well, I marked down all my shawls that are in my shop and the cowls and hats to try to clear them out. Uh, so if, if, you, if you're in the need for those things, that, there's some really good deals in there because I marked the prices down and it's, they're good. They were good before, but now they're really, really good. So uh, if you want to go check them out, I want to thank everybody who's always goes over to my Etsy shop, even if you can't purchase anything, just favoriting the things in my shop, and favoriting my shop helps to get me out so more people can find me, and I want to thank all of you who have bought from me, um, it really helps me out, uh, also I've been de a little bit of my yarn, so I still got a little bit of yarn on my Etsy shop, um, if you want to go check it out. So, I want to thank you all so much for supporting my Etsy shop, the ones who have, and everything, because it really means a lot to me. Um, so, I'm just going to jump in with these um, mystery bags and see what I got in here. Um, the box isn't very big, but I think I got four mystery bags. Uh, I got, think I got two crochet ones and two knitted ones. And the bags are small, <laughs> but... They wasn't but like $17 and something after I got a discount and stuff on it, I think. Let's see, I might have a shipping thing in here that tells me. Um, tells me. It says, thank you for your order. We hope you enjoy your new yarn and we appreciate you supporting our small business. I totally understand. It's Aberdeen Wools. And they're the ones that have the the tangle points, the little uh, minis that people use. I, I made a blanket and a, a shawl and stuff with my little minis I get from them. Um, so let's see. Let me put this box back down here. Uh, also, y'all, my internet and cable and all that's been off. We didn't have no storms or anything, but the place that's like, the, I guess it's the head end where all the stuff is at that runs the internet and stuff, it caught a fire and burned down. And so it took us almost a week to get it back on. And um, so I hadn't had no internet 
or anything like that. Now, I did have some, you know, on my phone, I had a little bit of, like, you get data and stuff where you don't have to be on the internet. But, um, other than that, I hadn't had any internet. Um, but it don't tell me how much I paid for these, but I think it was $17 and something. And I don't think it tells you if it's knit or crochet, so we won't know that till I open it. But I'm fixing to open this one and see. I hope everybody's been doing good, and I hope you're all staying uh, well and safe because a lot of sickness has been going on. Um, and a lot of people in our Yarny community has been sick and having, you know, things going on. Um, let's see. Who was it? Somebody had gotten these, and I thought, well, I hope I get... It might have been Juan, the yarn addict. I think it was. He had gotten some of these bags and he had that Viva yarn or something that come in his. I hope I get some of that. Oh, here's some Barocco Lana's Light 100% wool. It's a number two fine. Um, 383 yards. It's nice. And the color number is 78108. Very nice. Um, and what's this? Ooh, this is soft. Ooh. Oh, Barocco Wizard. Oh, man, it's like a chain spun. And it's so soft. Uh, it's got 262 yards on it. Uh, color number 2969. Barocco, Barocco Wizard. 85% superwash wool. And 15% nylon. Very nice. Isn't that nice, y'all? Got that. And then I got... Oh, I got some of this before. And I thought about putting it in my... Um, on my Etsy shop. You know, when I'm de-stashing. Because I probably ain't going to use it. But it's nice, especially if people want to make socks and stuff. But it's the KFI Collection Indulge Organic Sock or Organic Merino Wool Blend. And it also says a free sock pattern included, I guess, on the label. And it says the color is Verbita Gardens. Color number 0108, made in Turkey. And they have 459 yards. It's pretty. So, it's like a sock thing. But, I mean, you could use it for other stuff besides socks. But that. Well, let's see. I have a. Let's see. This is a. Uh, knitting. So, this must be the knitting. One of the knitting bags. I'm not sure, but. It has a uh, uh, slouchy beanie. Ooh, it gave me several of them. Patterns. Huh. And then, here I think this is crochet. No, this is knit too. So all these are knitted. There's a scarf like and then the the beanie and oh this is pretty. It's knitted just a shawl. It comes with a chart. So, that was in that bag. So, let you get a closer look, I guess, at the, the colors of the yarn. But these were in the mystery, the mystery bags from um, Aberdeen Wools. This is soft, y'all. That's nice. So, 
that down there and then we'll open up this one <laughs> am i still recording yeah let's see mm. oh this is nice Ooh. this is queensland's collection organic shetland wool it's kind of woolly but i like it it is uh, color 29 aquamarine. It's the number two fine, 157 yards. Um, and it's called Walkabout. And I got three of them. I like it too, y'all. Even though it, it, it's not really scratchy, but, it's, you know, it's, it's, it's got some roughness to it. But I like it. I really love those colors. Uh, let's see what else I got. Ooh, this dolly baby. <laughs> oh, these are nice, y'all. Dolly baby, um, Lanes du Nord. I have to show it to you because I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it right. It's um, merino wool and it's a luxury line called Dolly Baby, and it's got lanesdenord.com, made in Italy, uh, color 213, 100% wool, unshrinkable, does it say, did I say how many, oh, two, uh, 254 yards on each one, y'all, this is nice, I don't, I don't think I see nobody get these. Ain't that pretty? I like it. I like this bag a lot. And then I have a another one of the sock collections. This is pretty pretty colors. It was the same as the other one. Um, this is called S A N T O R I N I. Color number one oh six. So that's pretty. Oh, I was going to let y'all look at the. Because I really can't pronounce that. Lanes Denar or something. Anyway, maybe you could see it. And then. That's pretty. Ain't that pretty? Okay. Let's see. Oh, this has got a sock pattern. Um. So, this is knitted socks, and this is a, a knitted cowl, it's pretty, ain't that pretty, sorry I'm shaking y'all. Uh, and then it has a Amy Simple shawl. It's pretty. And it's knitted, but I can't knit it, y'all. So, that was in that bag. So, I like that bag. I like that. And I like this. So, those were the knitting, so this must be the crochet. <laughs> So let me get this one open. Oh, Y'all know how weak I am. Ooh, see some pretty stuff in here, y'all. Ooh, what's this? Ooh. Ah, Juniper Moons Farm. Harriet. Pure Extra Fine Baby Alpaca. Oh my gosh, is this ever so soft? Look at that, y'all. And I think these bags was like $17 and something. And um, this has got 219 yards on it, 100% alpaca. Colors 1083. Um, it's a lightweight number three. Oh, it's so nice. 
so nice. Ain't that pretty? And then we have another organic. They're all different colors. I mean, they, none of them the same color, I don't think. But this is a pretty color. I like this one. The sock wool. Organic merino wool blend. 75% organic wool and 25% polyamide. 459 yards of a super one. One super fine. Mondovino, M-O-N-D-O-V-I-N-O -O -O is the color name, and it's 107, but that's pretty. I like that. Oh, what's this? I'm getting stuff I never had before. Babe Soft Cotton Chunky. Steel Blue, color 23. 55% uh, 55% acrylic, 45% cotton. I love cotton and acrylic blends. And it's a bulky number five, and it's nice. It's, it's tightly wounded, too. The, the yarn, ain't that beautiful? Oh, my, my. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. So... I like that. And that's it. In that bag. Oh, what's this? Oh, this is a crocheted cowl. Very nice. And Oh, some crocheted socks. Cute. Look at those. Oh, and some crocheted stash baskets. Cute. So I like those patterns. Very nice. Okay, one more. Alrighty. I love that, y'all. That's that's nice. I think that was it in that bag. Nice yarn, y'all. And I did it in for the price. You can't beat it. Ooh, I think I did get some like, was it Juan? I think it was Juan who got yes, who got this. And so Webbs was having a sale. And I went on Webbs and I think I, it was this and I ordered me some more on webs that were having a sale but i love this yarn y'all it's the barocco vivo vivo remember how you pronounce it 100 percent cotton 317 yards and it's made in italy and it's the lightweight number three color number 3516 y'all i love this machine washing cold water on delicate cycle and lay flat to dry Oh, I love it, y'all. Very nice. Very, very nice. And then I got another sock. They're trying to get rid of this socks, sock yarn. This one is the color M-O-N-T-E-V-E-R-D-E, -E -E, color 102. So that one. Oh, let's see what this is. Oh, this is Barocco Dulce. D-U-L-C-E. 50% cotton, 20% nylon, 16% alpaca, and 14% wool. Very nice. 175 yards. Um, and washing cold, lay flat to dry. Very nice, y'all. What what weight is it? Oh, it says a number four medium, but that's because of the the halo on it because it's not no four. See how thin that is? But it's pretty yarn. Look. Very nice. So I got two of those. And 
this thing. Man. Oh, oh my goodness, a dragon fin chalet. Naughty magpie designs. Oh, that is so pretty. See about that. And another pair of socks. Those are nice. And this doesn't have a picture, but it's a cowl, a bandito cowl by Chris Basta, B-A-S-T-A. So the, the pattern's not very long, but anyway, that was the, that's what I got, and I love this. This is my very very favorite, and then probably this one. But I like them all. They're all very nice. So I think Aberdeen Wools always has nice mystery bags. Okay, so y'all want to see what I finished? I finished another Boggy Creek blanket. And uh, if this is Crystal over at Bag O'Day. This is her pattern. She's been putting out a lot of uh, Chevron crochet tutorials. And so I made this one. I really like it very nice and I don't think I'm going to put a border on it what do y'all think should I it's very nice ain't it I like it so this will go to Boggy Creek very nice and this is I'll put the, the tutorial in the description box that I used and I'll tell you about the yarn um, I used Big twist in the remember I got these big twist value pounds plus and this is the color uh chocolate brown is in there um watermelon is in there uh this yarn is so nice y'all this is the best yarn value of acrylic yarn I have ever felt. Teal. I love Big Twist. And uh, then I use Big Twist in the yellow. Um, Varsity yellow. And the Big Twist in the deep red. Oh, that's the colors that are in there. And white. I didn't bring it. It's in, I think it's wrapped up over here. But I used the white and the big twist. And so, and then I'm making this one. It's another one of Crystal's uh, chevrons that she's put out. Yeah, here's the white that I'm using in this one and in this one. But this one I'm doing in the, in the deep red and the big twist and the white and the big twist and the teal and um so this is this is this one i'm making so ain't that pretty red white and blue <laughs> but i like it so am i showing you the right way oh i think this is the right Ain't that pretty? So, I've been working on that. And that's about it. Uh, so, but I'm on the mend, y'all. And I hope it won't be long before I can come back on and share another video with y'all. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. Um, also, don't forget to go check out my Etsy shop. I just did an update on there. And then I marked some stuff down that was already on there. And everything, if you want to go look at it. And, um, so I hope everybody stays safe and well. Uh, also, a lot of people have been sick in the, in the crochet community. I know Mama, Mama, Llama Mama Kayla. If you don't know her, I'm going to link her below. You need to check her out. She's such an inspiration. She's such a very strong lady. And she has, she has a wonderful channel. And I'm pretty sure you most, most all of you probably know her. But, um. She's a crochet channel, and she does beautiful work. 
um, she, she's just, a, a, like, sitting down and watching, you know, it's like sitting down with a friend, she's really, really a, a great person, and, but anyway, she, she only has a thumb on one hand, and she had three fingers on the other hand, and she's got, uh, health issues and problems that causes her, she's lost her fingers, most all of them. Now on that hand, she had to get this one removed. So on this hand, she's only got her thumb and her pinky. So y'all please keep her in your prayers. She, she's, she's, she smiles through it all. She is just, she's a one strong lady. One strong lady is all I can say. And, um, and she's just, She's just a joy. She's just a blessing to a lot of us. But anyway, y'all remember her in your prayers. And also D over Creative Hands. She's been sick. Y'all pray for her. And um, I think Granny D had been sick. A lot of people's been sick. And um, so we just have to pray for one another, y'all. <laughs> but okay, I'm going to get off of here. I love you guys. And I hope to be back on again soon. Y'all take care. Bye.